Hello and welcome to Imperator Room. My name is Menturius and welcome back to our great super writer, super, super Achia. Well, I'm, I'm going to call it super, super land because, well, we are growing like crazy. We're not at war anymore. Let's take a look at a political situation. We have like small pieces of land in all areas, but well, why are we drew? Most important thing is that we We'll get like one culture, we're kinda all Celtic Iberian, but uh, it would be nice if we got like one culture and we should prepare for our next war. Our stability is quite high, our aggressive expansion is also quite high. The plan in the last episode was to take this last area, therefore I do need to take a look at who my lie to. Yeah, that, those three. We got like peace treaties with these two guys. And uh, we got some military access. Well, that ain't the biggest problems. We have a lot of good trade going on. And we have a defensive leak. That's kind of problem, that one. All right, let's take a look at you guys. So we got quite a big defensive league going on there. It's kind of funny. Yeah, you got with the big guy in the south. Alliance. Oh, that's definitely not going to go. Uh, so I guess. I really want to to go to war with this guy. So I guess we need to prepare. We got one scorch family. We got a little bit disloyal province. And well, that's because of the freemen. And what are we going to do to make them more happy? Don't want to spend all the oratory power, make religion endowment. Hmm. Let's see if we can get some more stuff traded, make our people more happy. Let's uh, first unpause the game and let's see what is going to happen because we got quite the army here. Current morale is quite high. Well, they've just been fighting, so let's speed it up just a little bit. The only biggest problem is this guy. So, who do you hate? I kind of want to know, is there like anyone? Oh, that's interesting. You are hating that guy. We got some cause bellies on him, but well, what just happened? Has initiated a wide range of restructuring of the officers under her command. And who? You're the clan chief. But you're the ruler. Yeah, well, let that be. I don't mind. We are trying to find a new target. 
And I'm kind of tempting to go with these guys. We got like 6k army here. But we really need to get our army up. Are you still allied with me? Problem is, I am allied with this guy. I kind of want to attack this guy. But then we will have a real diff difficulty getting this. But they won't join me, show superiority. We got a lot of allies. It's just going to be unpausing and getting my moral up. I'm even thinking of constructing a road from the north to the south. That way my army will move faster. Our economic is quite going quite well. What just happened here? Are you at war? You are. Why aren't you inviting me? Interesting. Interesting, interesting. And again, way too many. So it's getting harder and harder to get a good grip on the enemy. This loyal province is kind of going down. I was kind of hoping to... Could do local autonomy. So you're the big guy. Oh yes, I definitely want to have you in my lines. That changes a lot. All oh, right, with this guy being my ally, we can definitely. Well, I don't mind being over limit. All right, let's see uh, our aggressive expansion is wrong culture, happiness. Yeah, he can join, he can join. All right, now I kind of want to fix the aggressive ex expansion or the aggressive expansion, the, yeah, the aggressive expansion. The wrong culture group is kind of the biggest minus point for me at the moment, and I guess that's in this one, so I guess we are going to go with changing that up a little bit. Mm, could use the money, could really use the money. All right, well, we got our 12k army. We are going to war. We are going to declare war. We are going to ask all our buddies to join. And I kind of need to have to fabricate a claim. We already have a claim. Oh, we already have a claim. Then we can go to war. Let's have some fun. And let's start some war. And the biggest party is honored, 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 they all honored. We immediately go take a little river crossing. I didn't notice that that fast. And let's slow down because I'm going way too fast again, as usual. It's kind of annoying that I always forget to put it off speed number five. Right, these three thousands. 
I didn't expect that guy to go in, but I guess we got the whole northern block. And that's not a bad thing. Where is the big army from the south? 16k, that's... Let them do the fighting, I'll do the... It's kind of funny how their old troops are coming in on my loyal... Oh, do I get control over you? Oh, I didn't even notice that. Uh, wait a second, you guys... Oh, wait. you guys cannot move as one. You guys come to this area. Take the city. I didn't even notice that. Who are you? I don't mind. Accept. Normally they say you need to look at the trade you do, but well, at the moment I kind of don't mind. Where is my big army? So I kind of guess we lost the first battle. That's kind of annoying. Now we need to think smart. Because my allies aren't the smartest people. There are way too many armies. Alright, let's pause, let's select our main army and let's get into this position as well. Now let's speed it up a little bit. Let them do the main fighting. I know it's kind of cheesy. But we should have way more than enough soldiers to fix this. By taking these two sections we can roam free to their country. They have like 30,000 troops. Where is our other main army? They're over there. Right, so we want our first siege. Get that main army. Because we do need to kick some ass somewhere. And as you can see, my ally isn't the most smartest guy. Oh man. No, this is a bad thing. This is definitely a bad thing. Alright, let's hope my allies are sending troops in, but I don't think this is going to happen. So it's going to be like 22,000 killing my butt. We kind of lost that. Hmm, that wasn't the best battle. Oh, come on. I'm in the middle of a war and you guys are going to make some crappy thing come up. She's a member of the Finrini family and your tribal chief, so I kind of want to go with the Dumas. Yeah. 
I could take the only 100. No, I'm going with loyalty. I don't want to risk that in a war. All right, so we seriously we have a serious problem here. Just because of the big troops, uh, where is that main army? You guys, you are going to recruit. I want to see what that army is looks like. Three, three four. One, two, three, four. So I got my main army being reinforced. And now that we have that location as well. Moral isn't up. High enough. Sending down my army to the south. We are going to take down that army. If we take a victory on the 8.7k Right, so we got a victory on their main army Now we need to push. Now we definitely need to push. to move for the last 11,000, 12,000 troops and that way we can stack and wipe them pretty easy. 15,000. Uh, we will have more troops incoming and they have way low morale. Morale is killing them and that's what makes this fun game fun and easy. We captured like the main army and let you guys take that area as well all right so after this we, we are going to have a pretty high aggressive expansion uh, we definitely need to do something do i got subject states i didn't even know that i think i did that the last government uh, merge these armies into one. I guess I cannot move do that. But let's take a look because I am really, I kind of forgot that I got like subject states, white peace. All 
Alright, so yeah, we definitely need to fix this. We got an omen. I kind of want to have something there. Yeah, drop my aggressive expansion. I wonder if I can piece out a few separately, like this one. Silver peas, you are going to become under my laws. You don't have that much money, but oh well. We are going to take a look at your families. I thought they had like 62,000 gold, but it's a little bit less. You are not good, not good, not good enough. Do I need any special people in my government? Let's take a look. I guess we definitely are going to do something to pump up my My stability. But let's see, I got an 8 and 10. No, I, I kind of only need this one, but. Mm, nope. Had rescues fight. It should make it a little bit easier. And we slowly. Slowly take these lands. Let's take a look because I really need to bump my stability. Do we get any? S no, we are not going to do any decisions. I want you to look a religion tab. Yes, because I have enough oratory power. Rural corruption. Right. Move that army in. My army should be able to win this. And we've got I wonder, can I see on a map who I'm dealing with because Oh yes. As you can see some lands are popping up. I don't mind you, you're way too far away for me to be in any trouble. As you guys can see, we easily win. Even though they have a lot more chariot, but their tactics is kind of the wrong one. Alright, let's take those lands as well. Right, so we want another war. That way. That way, you. Super peace. Ding, 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 ding. And a lot of money, 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 money. And I want to take the land as well. Alright. We are scorching the families. I still don't see a reason. Ooh, this one has 10 oratory power. But their popularity is quite high. If the popularity wasn't that high, I... And the corruption is as well, so... Like this family, is, it's way better. Zero corruption, 80 loyalty. And popularity is quite low as well. Hmm, but you, yeah, you got like a seven in. If you got a if you had like an eight or a ten in in the civic power, I would definitely keep them. But for now, let's crucify them. Why didn't the land turn into my land? 
Didn't I? Oh, I didn't press the button. <laughs> I guess I didn't press the button. I totally forgot to press the button. That that is kind of stupid. Starting pops, all right. Hmm. Well, that's pity. Where's the big army I went to? Did we totally stack wipe their army? Let's speed it up. Let's see if we shoot them for peace. Take this area and this area. How much money can we take? Because the aggressive expansion is quite high. Yeah, I guess this is going to be it. We are going to end the war here. And we've just become a regional power. And, ooh, they aren't even a regional power, so we have to guarantee them. Oh man, this, this is, this is how we become big and strong. But I guess in the next episode we will have to look for new friends. Uh, we're definitely going to split up this army. Because it's way too big. So like you, going to the capital. you go to that area i hope you guys all enjoyed this episode i definitely did and i would have taken this as well but well for now i am pretty glad what we did so far super atia is going pretty well and we should take a look at our financial situation because a minus three isn't that a good situation we got an unused freight route, so that's something we have to look into that. We got a military tradition, we can also look into that live infantry defense. That's definitely something we are going to do. So, until the next episode of Imperator Rome. See you guys next time.